The evolution of software development has reached greater heights in the recent times. The current IT industries demand the most efficient and updated software development skill in the market. And there is no better way than upgrade your skills. Hey everyone, welcome to yet another exciting video from Simply Learn. In this session, we will be discussing the first programming language. But before we begin, make sure that you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you can never miss an update from Simply Learn. However, before we begin, let's take a look at the agenda for today's session. First, we shall begin with learning what exactly is programming. Then, I will walk you through our next topic where we will understand why we need to learn programming. Then, we dive deep into learning the history of programming. After that, we shall begin with learning the first programming language. Later, we will walk you through learning what everyone looks for in programming and how it impacts one's career. After that, we move into the next section of top and trending programming languages. Finally, we will wind up the session by discussing the steps to improve programming. I hope I was clear with the agenda. Now, let's start with our first topic. What is programming? Programming is the process of designing and building executable programs to work on specific tasks that involves analysis, generation and implementation of algorithms. Many of the applications and development involves and uses programming. Programming involves tasks such as analysis and generation of algorithms, resource consumption and profiling of algorithms and the implementation. There are a few words of programming. Now let's have a look at why exactly we need programming. These days programming has become one of the biggest advantages for implementing and developing new and trending technologies. The applications and the technologies implemented are ruling the world. There is a huge demand for coders and programmers which is the most significant benefit in the career growth of a person. These help to grow the knowledge and methodology and increase the ability to think profoundly and update the new ways of living. It is a great opportunity and a way to start a business because of the advantage and the growth in this software field. There are a few reasons why we need programming. Now, let's see some of the history about programming languages. In the year 1954, Fortran was invented by IBM at the team led by John Backus. It was the first widely used high-level general purpose programming language to have a functional implementation instead of just design on paper. When Fortran was first introduced, it was viewed with skepticism due to bugs, delays in development and comparative efficiency of hand-coded programs written with assembly. The first high-level programming language was Plankerkel, developed by Konrad Zeus for his Z1 computer between 1943 and 1945, but not implemented at the time. Other languages still in use today include LISP, invented by John McCarthy, and COBOL, created by Short Range Committee. So this was some history about the programming languages. Now let's dive into learning the first programming language. The first functioning programming languages designed to communicate instructions to a computer were written in the early 1950s, proposed by John Macaulay's short code in 1949. It was one of the first high-level languages ever developed for an electronic computer. Later in the year 1954, Fortran was invented by IBM by a team led by John Backus. It was the first widely used high-level general purpose programming language to have a functional implementation instead of just a design on paper. When Fortran was first introduced, it was viewed with skepticism due to its bugs. It is still a popular programming language for high-performance computing and is used for programs that benchmark and rank the world's fastest supercomputers. Now, let's understand what everyone looks for in the programming these days. Learning many programming languages is tough, so people look and choose the best one which can be easy to understand. Companies also look for employees who are good at programming and coding. Almost all the people with the best programming knowledge will have great ability to improve the business. Development is easy when we are good at programming and coding. The knowledge of coding and programming also impact much growth in career and opportunities. Now, let's have a look at how it impacts one's career. 
At present, the demand for software is increasing and it requires a lot of developers and engineers to develop the applications, which is a huge advantage. A lot of jobs are available and it holds a key advantage in choosing the best career. It is pretty easy to find a job with good skills. Programming also improves the ability and knowledge of a person and makes them more confident. Now, let's see some top and trending programming languages at present. So the first one in the list is Python. Python is the most preferred programming language because of the syntax of Python programming can be very easy to understand for every level of reader. And this programming language is also loaded with libraries that help in implementing scientific computing. Working and deployment in Python are supportive and easy in any kind of environment. And next one in the list is Java. In the modern time, Java is the best language to choose. Nearly thousands of applications, software and development tools are built using the Java programming language. This technology is mainly used in creating websites such as YouTube, Google, Amazon and many more. And the third one in the list is C Sharp. C Sharp is a general purpose multi-paradigm programming language. C Sharp encompasses static typing, strong typing, lexically scoped, imperative, declarative, functional, generic, object oriented and component oriented programming disciplines. The fourth one in the list is JavaScript. JavaScript is responsible for fast and secure development. The main advantage and prospectives are to provide more interactivity with the users and coders. It also helps in expanding innovative technologies which involve animation, gaming and rendering. And the fifth one in the list is R. R programming language is very scalable and makes it easy to build aesthetic web applications. This language is mainly developed by using statistics and data science knowledge. R acts as a cross-platform because of the ability to run on any operating system. The fifth one on the list is PHP. PHP is a general purpose scripting language geared towards web development. It was created by Danish Canadian programmer Rasmus Lerdoff in 1994. The PHP group now produces the PHP reference implementation. PHP originally stood for personal home page but now it stands for recursive initialism PHP. Now let's have a look at the final section of the session where we will discuss about the steps to improve programming. The main problem in learning is consistency. When we work in our free time, it doesn't help much because of the power of our brain. Working daily helps in gaining and boost up our knowledge and helps in thinking logically and improve our skills. So we have to work every day to learn programming. If you're going to learn something, you must start from the beginning. It helps to predict and provides a complete understanding of the upcoming topics. If you're learning coding or programming, you better start from the basics. It helps you more to grab the attention over the subject and improve your coding and programming knowledge. One of the accessible sources of learning coding and programming is online resources. There are plenty of online resources like Simply Learn, etc. These platforms offer free courses and videos with the best concepts that you have ever seen. One of the accessible sources of learning coding and programming is online resources. There are plenty of online resources like Simply Learn, etc. These platforms are providing and helping much in learning. They also offer free courses and videos with best concepts that you have ever seen. When you get deeply involved in the subject we are learning, it provides a way to gain more knowledge and attention over the subject. The deeper we put in an effort, the more we get back. It also helps us in improving our thinking skills. It boosts the performance while performing the tasks. And this was all for today's session. I hope now you guys have got an idea of the first programming language and where to start. If you find the information helpful to build and improve your knowledge of coding and programming, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, would you please let us know in the comment section? Our team of experts will be happy to resolve all your queries. Until next time, thank you for watching and stay tuned for more from Simply Learn. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.